As the world is changing, we always have to try to make it better. Continuous improvement is a very, very strong DNA in the minds, in the heart of Toyota people, wherever they operate. Since 1991, Toyota has donated to various causes in the United States, mostly focused on environment, safety, and education. When we do identify a partner, we're really looking to develop that relationship. For us, it's more than just writing a check. The National Center for Family Literacy and Toyota, writing the 20th year of our partnership, it's just made amazing things happen in this country. The parents go in and they come back and say, now I know how my child learns. Now I know how I can help them at home. You know, Toyota came with, we want to help you be successful. And, and we really don't want to dictate to you what you need to do with our resources. We want you to tell us what would be best for the program. Our um, director of development came to me and said that she had gotten an email about the 100 Cars for Good program, and she said, do you think we should apply? And I well, I'm not sure, and she said, I think we should just try. Instead of us choosing where to give money or support, we let the people choose through the social media, so that is a neat part of it. Unless you are here, you don't see the true impact of it. For us, we're dealing with more than 2 million car sales, but Really, one car makes such a big difference. Within Toyota, there's always things that are changing. A lot of people talk about giving back to society, but I think that what Toyota is doing is giving forward. The research that we're doing through the Collaborative Safety Research Center is really not just for Toyota, but it's really something to improve traffic safety in America. Is set up right from the beginning to be collaborative and to use outside partners, federal agencies, and research hospitals. Our partners are really motivated, they're really excited to work with us, and that's what's most exciting to me. The whole activity to give back to the community where we do business has been a philosophy ever since we started because it's, we believed in this grassroots, very important. One of the questions uh, we ask ourselves is, what will this community look like in 20 years? So in addition to manufacturing vehicles, we're trying to improve communities over the long term. Our team members have been great giving back to their community. And I'm proud to work for Toyota because they respect me, they respect our customers, and they respect our community. Toyota has terrific environmental values. They believe deeply in conservation. We're actually finding people in communities all across the country who are doing some good environmental research and we're giving them funding that allows them to take whatever project they're working on to the next level. My project with young people from inner city communities around Boston and showed them the importance of environmental issues. But the partnership between Toyota and Audubon helped me see that the work that I'm doing in Boston is actually it has national relevance. And I'm hoping that as I've passed it on to um, the teenagers that I work with, that approach will be what changes this whole conservation environmental movement. In New Orleans, after Katrina hit, so many homes were wiped out, and there's a really ambitious home building effort going on there. We've actually helped them make that process more efficient. Liz and I came down to St. Bernard in February 2006. We decided that we were going to start rehabbing the houses and putting them back together. You know, Toyota is really committed to helping communities after disasters. What we try to do is take the Toyota production system model as it might apply to manufacturing and translate that to the process of building homes. It used to take us before Toyota anywhere from 12 to 18 weeks to rebuild a house. We just did two houses in six weeks. It is very important to find out what the real need is. You go yourself and see yourself so that you really see the nature of the problem. The Toyota way is to, to respect everyone and to come in and, and listen to ideas and constantly thinking about, you know, what are the ways we can improve? And it's, I think, a model for the nation about what philanthropy can do.